So let's talk about directing our sound. It's kind of silly, but it's fun. We are going to use a vowel, ooh, and we're going to think about where that sound can move to. And the first place is the front of the lips, because we usually talk and we sing and we think about this. When we're singing, everything seems to be right here, because when we talk, everything is right here, right? It doesn't have to be when we're singing. Check it out. Ooh, right here on the lips, right? Now, imagine the sound being further back, maybe in the middle of your tongue. Yeah. Now imagine it being a little bit further back, maybe behind the jaw, the back of your tongue. Now imagine it going a little bit further back. Remember we talked about that seal? So let's put it all together. I kind of like directing the sound back because as we sing, we want to think about it being here. It allows it to be easier here. It's kind of weird, but it sort of works. So let's use favorite things. And let's talk about where we feel the sound. Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. Cool. Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. Cool. Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. Raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. Bright copper kettles and wobble in mittens. Bright paper packages tied up with string. These are a few of my favorite things. Depends on what you want to do with it. I like the ease. If I want it big, I can make it big. If I want to make it small. Cream colored ponies and crisp apple strudel. Doorbells and sleigh bells and schnitzel with noodle. It's kind of fun. Play with your sound. It's silly, but goodness, it's yours. Make it amazing. There's only one you. Be the best you you can be.